Unity is a very fascinating word, and one that I'm glad to talk about. Unity is a very simple word, very simply said, but also very difficult to put into practice. In 2019, when I first came here, uh, if you were to tell me that I was going to take over the case to call Republicans and revitalize and revamp the organization, I would have said, you are absolutely joking, get out of my face. Uh, but lo and behold, uh, I found myself in that position. And I realized that I had to take that group and center that group around a message. So I chose the message of unity. Now, I'm not here to talk about the things that we've done in the case. So I'm not really here to talk about my Republic fam necessarily as I call them. Uh, you can go to my Facebook, you can go to our Instagram, and you can look at all that, and that's a great show. But what I do want to discuss with you all is what happens when you pursue unity. In my pursuit of unity, I have found myself closer to God. In my pursuit of unity, I have found a beautiful soul that is sharing this portion of her life with me, and hopefully more as time goes on. In my pursuit of unity, I found a family equivalent to that of the family I found in the Marine Corps. In that pursuit of unity, I found community represented by all the faces that I see here tonight, especially Jim. <laughs> In my pursuit of unity, I have found an effective, successful campaign in bringing conservative ideology and ideas to a college campus. In the pursuit of unity, it has led me and others to all of these amazing things. And what I see here tonight is an amazing potential. Truly, it's an amazing potential. It's something with incredible possibility. I see a a county republic fan, if you will. And what an amazing thing we can accomplish when we work together and we aspire for unity. Truly. I see here tonight a representation of a strong cabinet, a representation of a patriotic cabinet, perhaps maybe a representation of a drunk cabinet. of a representation of a unified Republican Cobb County. And how amazing is that? Let the Democrats fight on that for a while, shaking their boots a little bit. So guys, I am in absolute awe at all of you present here tonight. I thank you so much for what you do for your community, uh, both for the Cobb County community and the Cobb County Republican community. So here's a toast. Here is to you all. Here is to Cobb County. Here is to unity. And here is to the red wave come November. Yeah. Yeah. Probably argue what science is nowadays. Oh, right? uh, 
uh, it's can't find a woman. No, no, no. Yeah, right. Man, tell me, you know, it's, it's happening at all the gym and classes. They're getting them at the very beginning of college, and then just finally reinforcing them as they go on. I'm gonna give you an example. I'm gonna use my girlfriend. Okay, Riley. She's beautiful. She's the Young Women's for America president. So we kind of go hand in hand, right? In her English education class. Okay, this is a class that you have to take to be a teacher for English. A teacher. Okay, for like middle school, elementary, high school, etc. She goes up to her teacher because you got to get your subject approved. She says, "I want to write on how there is more of." An idea to get abortion when you know that the child before it's born has some kind of mental issue or physical disability. I want to write on that. The teacher says, no, no, this unit is not, keep this in mind, this unit is not about sex. This unit is about mental disorder. Focus on mental disorder, that is all. So she's like, okay, I will focus on mental disorder. So you can do two things. You could write a paper or you could write a theoretical lesson plan. So the due date comes, she comes in, she presents her paper, she wrote a very generic but fine paper about mental disorder and the effects of it on society. Well, the last person comes up, I'm going to reiterate, this is a teaching for future teachers. The last person comes up and presents a hypothetical theoretical uh, lesson plan from the elementary school level, I was in pre-K to fourth grade on the education of sex, sexual choice, sexual orientation, uh, identifying what sex you are on the inside and the outside, and the teacher okayed this. So the teacher did not okay my girlfriend's paper on the account of the, uh, the sex topic, but for some reason let this individual make a lesson plan entirely from elementary school pre-K about why sex and sexual orientation, etc. Is, is an acceptable thing to discuss. That is happening at your colleges. That is happening at your colleges. And guys, that's that's scary. Yeah, they're teaching the young people. Yes, yes. So here's here's the fascinating thing: is these things are traumatic. These ideas are very traumatic. When you introduce these traumas to a young generation, a young generation, you're introducing into them trauma and trauma that they didn't have to have. I'm not going to get too much into the details, but I had somebody very close to me uh, with an individual who was in sixth grade. Uh, for two years, it took two years for that individual to kind of come out and talk to her parents. But for two years, she got told to go kill herself. In sixth grade, up to eighth grade, she got told to go kill herself because she would not accept another uh, young person's uh, approach to her, telling her that, hey, you're my lesbian girlfriend. And the entire class came together saying, you're a bigot, you're you know, this, you're that, you should go kill yourself. These kids are not ready to deal with this. They're not emotionally ready to deal with this. And this is what's happening. It's very real. It's not just rhetoric. It is a thing that is occurring, and it is a thing that the KSU College Republicans, the College Republicans in general for that matter, ought to be fighting. And we are. And we are. We're not letting these professors get away with it. We're not. In fact, we're going to talk about it. making videos on it as we speak. We're going to show folks this is the reality. This is what people are experiencing. And it's an amazing thing. It's an amazing thing. But on a positive note, we're doing something. We had 37 individuals sign up at our fair just the other day. Absolutely excited. presenting ourselves a lot more on campus. The Republic fam, as I call it, is increasing. And it will increase. We will dominate. In fact, we are uh, trying to take over SGA, which is the student government. Uh, it's, it's going to be a fascinating ride, uh, one that I, I plan on leading in about a year, but in good hands. In good That's hands. the thing. He's grooming good the hands. new people. Yeah. Grooming is such a pesky word. Oh, <laughs> Well, this might be getting ahead of the game a little bit, but when you leave in a year, what office are you going to run for? No, no, man, no, don't do that to me, Jim. I don't know, brother. You, know, you got to understand, I, 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 you'd be a good candidate. I, I, I told you, you know, how the pursuit of this unity, the pursuit of the Republic family building up has led me more to God. And I cannot tell you how much... Pastor. Yeah, well, maybe not a pastor. I don't know if I'm mad. But I cannot tell you how much that is... 
become the forefront in all of my decisions. It's like, Jim, it's like you see a door, and then you see another door open, and you start seeing the pattern, you just want to keep following that door. It's like when I got tapped to say, hey, do you want to run for House District 35? I got asked. But I did not see in my path God pushing me in that way. Arguably pushing me towards more getting out of the Marine Corps and working with the college 12 years. So I'll tell you, yeah, of course on my human side, I discussed this earlier, I, I would love to run for office. I would love to represent people. I would love people. You have lots of time. Sure. You know, but I also need to see God pushing me in that section. Well, maybe that the life is coming right by you. Maybe. Maybe, Mrs. Fisher. Maybe. Slightly, 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 slightly,